Okay, here we are at, this is the behind, uh, courtyard behind Notre Dame, sitting in a nice little seat here. And I just came out of a gift shop where I bought a brand new memory card for this flip cam because it was not working and it was telling me that it had no internal memory. And so I thought that the uh, memory card must be broken. So I had to take it out and show it to a clerk and buy a brand new one. Stuck the old one back in and suddenly this one is working again. So <laughs> Apparently, you know, Murphy's Law works again. Which is good because at least this way I have a working memory card even though I now have two memory cards apparently. But that's okay. Uh, what a day it's been. I'm sitting here now with a green apple slushy, quite yummy. And so I just got out of Notre Dame not too long ago. I've been to the Louvre and uh, well that's been most of my day. It's uh, I got a late start. Right now it's what six o'clock? Yeah this morning I slept thinking that I would just wake up naturally and be ready to go first thing in the morning like I was in London and uh, Woke up at 10 till 11 this morning, and uh, so yeah, I got a late start. See, France just makes people miserable sometimes, but that's okay. C'est la vie, no? So anyway, let's get up, I'll pack up my stuff, and now that I know that I have a working camera, let's give you a quick tour around the back side of the building here. Oh, make sure I don't lose all these expensive books that I bought. Mostly from the Louvre. Ah, here we have a nice wet fountain. I think that's a fountain. I haven't really looked around here yet. I just kind of saw that I could come in a gate and there were benches and I collapsed for a bit. Get my thumb out of the camera. Lens view. Ah, beautiful. And look, flying buttresses. Try not to giggle. Ah, those buttresses, they sure do fly well. And shall we take a time to stop and smell the roses? This is... I've had a day and a half in Paris. Got into town yesterday afternoon and set out on a trek. Oh... Oh, towards evening-ish I went out and I saw the Eiffel Tower a couple of times. Well, I saw it in the daylight and then I came back towards the end and uh, saw it towards dusk. And when... That's when they turn on the lights, and uh, at 10 o'clock everything went blinky and flashy on the tower, and it was quite pretty. And, uh, okay, you've seen flowers before, I'm sure. Let's take a look at this. So anyway, it was very flashy and pretty, but I had no idea that France is quite as far north as it seems to be, because it was 10 o'clock and just barely getting to be dusk last night. So I was out for a bit, and, uh, yeah, I had a good time. I took a Seine River cruise. It was pretty nice. So I haven't really recorded much as far as uh, videos go because, like I said, I just now have a working camera. But while I was standing in line for the Louvre today, I started jotting down some notes for a journal. So, note to self, lines in Paris, they're really not kidding. They are pretty damn long, but they do move. They move quite well. So, you know, I kept walking and writing. So I'll be lucky if I can read my own handwriting, but that's okay. I'll show you, let's, let's take a walk and I'll show you what the line looked like if it's still the same as what I saw earlier.